Well, I'm glad he's gone, but it's a bit of an odd replacement choice, don't you think? Hi, it's me again, and yet David Williams will no longer be a judge on Britain's Got Talent, which I can't say is a bad thing, because it was his own brand of wackiness bringing it to him. He was trying to turn it into the David Williams show, wasn't he? And I quite like Britain's Got Talent, so I'm quite glad he's gone. I know it's dumbed down TV, and I should watch documentaries about stuff, but I'm not going to. I like watching some tat sometimes when you're just sitting there. And you can watch this without a telly license because you watch it on ITVX, don't you? So who's replacing him then? It seems like a bit of an odd choice to me. There was rumours it was going to be Alan Carr, which I didn't really see because Britain's got talent. You think the judges would have some level of talent. Oh, don't get me started on a couple of the other judges anyway. So let's have a look who's replacing him, shall we? Britain's Got Talent bosses have lined up a reality TV legend to replace Judge David Williams after he quit the show last year. Strictly Come Dancing star Bruno Tognoli will be taking on the role, The Sun reports. A source said Bruno was always Simon's preferred choice. Not only does he have years of judging experience under his belt from his time on Strictly, he will bring an outrageous brand of comedy that BGT needs on the panel. And, and let's not forget, I would imagine he was a lot cheaper than David Williams. I bet it's a lot cheaper than David Williams. But yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, you could judge the dancing acts, I suppose. But is he qualified to judge a juggler or a stand-up comedian or a choir? Or any of them, for that matter? Because isn't where's, where Amanda Holden, the least talented woman in the world, is a judge on there? And Alicia Dixon, who was who just did little MC bits in a small hip-hop slash garage group in the early 2000s. She's qualified for that as well. But that is half the fun. But I didn't like David Williams doing it. I didn't see, I didn't see the attraction. In it. And I bet Bruno's a lot cheaper. So let's see, let's see how it works out. Because I like America's Got Talent as well. And they had, what was her name? That, that woman who thought she was a supermodel, the one from the 90s. Ah, oh, what was her name? It's going to drive me mad. Ah, it was Tyra Banks. Tyra Banks. I quite like watching America's Got Talent because she did get some wacky stuff on there. But she was awful. And it almost ruined the show. Almost ruined the show. And they replaced him, replaced her even, with Terry Crews, who you wouldn't think would be a thing for that. But he's blooming brilliant. And it really turned the show around. So maybe Bruno Tognoli will really turn Britain's Got Talent around. Guess we'll find out soon enough, won't we? What do you think about this then? Do you like X Factor and Britain's Got Talent and all that stuff? I I know it's low form of TV. I know it's dumb down TV. But sometimes you just want to watch some dumb down TV. There's no shame in it. You're allowed to like what you like. And I quite like Britain's Got Talent, America's Got Talent, all of that. Let me know your thoughts about it down in the comments below. And as always, thanks for watching. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Because that way, hopefully I'll see you in another video again soon. When I Ta-da!